advantage in lane, and Yi appears oh, he's himself. He's ulting, the got down. The, the Mundo doesn't have ultimate. The Orn taking Ooh. the tower aggro once Yi alpha striked, and there's oh, first blood first going blood. down to Yi. Why did Ryder ever oh. design his champion? Oh. Except maybe survive. There's the Azir oh. ult being thrown down, pushing the uh, the Kindred away, but now the Tarek ultimate going down in the bot lane. Pushing down onto the uh, the bot side oh, here, the tower well taking placed. a lot of damage. The greed almost coming out from the Tarek. The Kaiser was sitting so low there. The Tarek ultimate not doing enough, but I believe as well when the Tarek ultimate does go off, the tower damage still does stack. It's yeah. still every consecutive tower shot. So even though he wasn't taking a lot of damage, but not time to talk about that. The Nautilus gets his pull in. The uh, the Kindred ults being laid down there. The Yi. Healing up, meditating, but there's a kill coming out for Kaiser. And the Infernal Drake looking like they will take that down. The Kindred, there is a ward there, so they are well aware. The Azir also coming down. The uh, the the Mundo teleporting in. There is a lot of damage coming out right now. The They are heavily prioritizing the dragon, though. Microlag was able to take down the dragon, so that is coming through. And oh, oh my goodness, blink and you'll just you'll miss Master it. Master Yi! Somehow, somewhere in between uh, Master Yi taking all the dragon health down, Craigsley just got deleted. That a, that's a nice! <laughs> I would love to Where? see a replay Where on did... that. Uh, hello, Rift Herald in the mid lane. There is no real uh, minion wave there to support the, the takedown of the mid turret, so that will probably be quickly taken down. Mm. And uh, yeah, done. So bit, maybe a little bit of a waste there, but blue side is now raining siege onto the oh, mid lane there. Come. Orn is coming straight through, being able to catch out the Tarek with the ult, throwing down the Q as well to maybe uh, push the uh, people back there. The Tarek ultimate coming down alongside the Kindred ult, keeping everyone alive. People are popping left, right, and oh. center, but the red team is currently keeping everyone more alive there with healing. And Mundo, you're trying to heal through all of it, but Orn headbutts himself in and being able to take down that Mundo. And that is another ace coming out from Chiefs. Whoa. Just playing up to their advantage there. Steamrolling coming through for Chisholm Chiefs. The momentum, yeah. that's just going to be continued on. They are grouped up all... What is he doing? Yeah, you... Wait, what is he doing? Looking for a little bit of an expect. <laughs> Going for the... He, wants, he, he, has been, the... he has been pinged out. Yeah, yeah, buddy, you are in the wrong position. Uh, he's gonna, he's but gonna... there is maybe a 1v4 oh. coming out. Yeah, <laughs> run away. Continue to run. Tarek is oh, there flashing nice over the flash. Tarek, son. The Orn now helping out the Yi, being able to throw out the ult as a defensive measure. No one wants to get caught in that ram's well, head he there. He distracted everyone, we picked up the dragon, so I'll take that as a win. Blade of the Ruin King, but, I mean, you don't need lifesteal if they're all dead. Here comes the engage by Orm. Yeah, there's the Orm headbutting it through, being able to take that down, the Tarek ultimate coming down, plus the Lord Ult, ult the, uh, the Mundo wanting to try to get in as close as possible. We're waiting on that Kindred ult to be popped, but the Tarek now trying to save as much as possible. The Tarek ult now actually coming down. That was Kindred's ult before. The Kaisar just being able to left to do whatever she wants. Mordor trying to do whatever he can to take her down. But the Kaisar flashing in. That is a triple for Kaisar. Yes. And there is a nice team. Uh, Let's go. Team fight there go for the Baron. Chiefs. Silas and who's that? Orm going mid to try to push some pressure on that mid in here. Well, they're going to do a, a zero two three split here where they got the Baron buff. Yeah, I mean, they at this point they are powerful enough that they can do that. Oh, and see there you later. Was a three. Here. They kind of changed it up now. They are now playing on the aggressive. Yeah. They're like, this is our fight. We are taking this inhibitor. Try and stop us. Yeah. The the Yi maybe get caught Whoa. out here. There's a, a bit of damage nice coming out through. The Flash coming through, saving the Yi again. The Silver Ult trying to catch the Yi as well. And here we see what Chisholm Chief should be doing as well, which is forcing the Baron fight there. Kindred had to go back to maybe buy something there. She does yeah. now have a uh, Runa's Hurricane. That but was melted. The Runa's Hurricane isn't going to be able to help you from that, which was an absolute uh, butter melting. That is um, the fastest I've seen Baron go down in a long time. Yeah, that was very quick. Cool. Well, it does help. It's going to be super so that is going, important. So to those who don't know, an Elder Drake, what that's going to do is it's going to, whenever you attack someone, it's going to apply a burn mark and reveal them, yeah. uh, which it's a huge burn mark. It adds crucially to the damage, but more importantly to that, it increases the benefits of every previous dragon you've taken. So therefore, oh. they have five dragons. They're going to be able to do a lot more damage here. And the Orn coming through. No one's taking the dragon here. But uh, Macintosh being able to take down the uh, the, kindred, uh, the kindred there in the mid lane. And then being able to also, the small boy going down by uh, the Azir. Azir sitting in the back line doing a lot of damage. The Orn getting the knock up here. But oh. the kindred 
Uh, sorry, the Kaisa being Kaisa. able to take down so much damage. 12 Whoa. and O. 12 O 10. 277 CS. He does You've damage. You've got to give it up to that Azir, though. He was such a threat. Yeah. Three of the Chiefs went down and, lift, and left unchecked. That Azir was just going to be able to uh, hit everyone from the back line, and there was nothing they are going to be able to do. Unfortunately, oh, nervous then. unfortunately that was, oh. the Kaisa got Guardian Angel, and being able to go invisible, being able to attack so frequently from every different angle. And I believe that this will that be is game. a game for the Chiefs. Let's go Chiefs!